Hey, Michael, thank you for doing all you do for writers and young writers alike. It means a great deal. You're welcome. My writing partner and I garnered some attention for our work and approached a manager we met at a film festival. He was very excited about us and our work, but wanted to quote unquote date before signing us. All right, let's all just take a second to get douche chills by that. Walk it off, kid. Let's, all right, let's, con let's continue. We suddenly were pitching Bad Robot and other production companies. He said we were doing great. Then suddenly, no phone calls, no return emails, just poof, gone, ghosted. We are baby writers and being the best we know how to be, really at a loss and honestly, completely gutted. Any thoughts? Yeah, I got thoughts. 90% of what I just read is fantastic news and you're focusing on the bad 10%? Not to get judgmental, I do the same thing, but still, this is all excellent news. First of all, someone in the business recognized that you and your partner had enough talent to take a chance on. Good for you, you guys are doing really good. That says a lot. Second, this all this guy did was follow through on what he promised. He said up top that he was a douche and he followed through on his promise. All right, now you're upset about that? He warned you. But he, he said he was going to date you, meaning like, you know, all right, let's see if this all works out. It doesn't work out. What happens in a bad one night stand? You run away. Is it honorable? No, but he warned you. Second, sorry, I just took an unnecessary act break there. But this guy gave you a lot, he, quite a bit. He set you up on some real big meetings. You still have those contacts. When the strike is over, you can still reach out to Bad Robot. That's a legit company, obviously, and pitch him another idea. Work on it with your partner. Keep coming up with ideas. You got way more. You have three contacts that you didn't have before that. Before this guy, you know, took you on. Amazing. Good for you. You should also continue doing what you did in the first place that got this guy's attention. Enter other film festivals. Keep making great stuff. Put it out there, and your work will be more appreciated, and you'll be seen by other people the same way this guy found you. This is fantastic news. You're doing something right. You're focusing on the one bad thing. Don't worry about it. And by the way, we all get ghosted, right? I was ghosted just a few months ago by somebody. I'd roll my eyes. Eh, whatever. I'll just find another way around this obstacle. This rejection part is part of the game. Now you are in the game, sucker. You are playing the game with all of us. All the, all the rest of us. Everyone in Hollywood has to go through this. And now you're doing it too. Fantastic. Congratulations. You're one of us now. This is not bad news. This is good news. So what's the game plan? You need to figure out what it was that wasn't getting you over the hump and just double down and get better and better at it. This guy was hoping that you would make him rich and you were hoping that he would make you rich. And then he decided it wasn't working out, but you were both using each other. This is how the game is played, but you still have the talent. He left, you still get to keep your talent. Double down, focus on what you got control on, which is your writing and continue to improve your craft. Keep putting out there and good things are gonna come your way. In five years, you're gonna laugh about this. You're gonna say, wow, Look at me. Look what I did. Congratulations. Keep it up.